Contracting parties often use pre-printed forms, like purchase orders or invoices, to memorialize their agreements. If one party makes an offer on a pre-printed form and the other party accepts with another pre-printed form, the forms are rarely identical. This is known as a battle of the forms. In the 2001 case, Commerce and Industry Insurance Company versus Bayer Corporation, we explore what terms are incorporated into a contract if a battle of the forms occurs. Malden Mills purchased nylon tow from Bayer Corporation. Malden Mills' purchase order contained an arbitration provision. Bayer's invoice, however, didn't contain an arbitration provision. Bayer's invoice expressly conditioned its acceptance on Malden Mills' assent to any different or additional terms contained in Bayer's invoice. Malden Mills didn't expressly consent to any different or additional terms. Nevertheless, Bayer shipped the nylon tow, and Malden Mills accepted it. In December of 1995, several of Malden Mills' buildings caught fire. Malden Mills alleged that the fire started when a static charge ignited the nylon tow it had purchased from Bayer. Malden Mills, along with its property insurer, Commerce and Industry Insurance Company, filed suit against Bayer, seeking to recover for the damages caused by the fire. Bayer moved to compel arbitration based on the arbitration provision in Malden Mills' purchase order. The trial court denied the motion. Bayer appealed directly to the Massachusetts Supreme Court which accepted the case.